Hello everybody, today I'm going to teach you how to record your PS3 gameplay directly to PC without an HDMI splitter. So as you know already, there is like a HDCP uh, for P uh, PS3. You can directly record your PS3 gameplay to the computer using uh, the HDMI cable. So, so I'm going to show you my setup. And of course last night we played Midnight Club LA. And yeah, here's my PS3. Of course, we have our PS5 here for our PS5 gameplay, and I'm doing PS2 game gameplay soon. So yeah, this this um, monitor uh, shows uh, my PS3 here, as you see, and this is my OBS. And yeah, you can see here uh, the PS3. Uh, the OBS I mean is capturing what's uh, in the PS3 you can't normally do that uh, for the PS3 because it has like the HDCP restriction uh, it sucks by the way but there is a way you can uh, still record or even stream your gameplay in HD okay with this one so this is what I normally have uh, excuse my messy room here my dirty table so uh, yeah, I'm using the Elgato HD60S capture card here for uh, yeah, capturing our gameplay. And yeah, this is what I use, the component cable. So this, these are the only two things that I bought, the, uh, the component cable here. By the way, this is still HD. You will know it because once you connect your uh, PS3, you, you go to the settings and display uh, settings. You you will be able to pick 1080p for this one if you connect the composite cable. So this is still HD, and this device right here, HD uh, video com converter converter. I mean, which uh, basically you will have an output uh, of. Uh, of HDMI so from this here the composite yeah this is the composite cable for my PS3 output again I'm not using HDMI anymore because it got uh, DC HDCP restriction so composite cable all the way here to the input and you will know there are different colors here except for this one so this is the audio uh, ports here then this is the input and the output yeah by the way this is powered uh, 5 volts you can use your phone charger yeah like this so output is HDMI goes here to the input you can see here in I don't know if it is uh, focusing so input of your Elgato capture card then the output is to the monitor and of course you got you have this uh, cable here which enables you to record your uh, gameplay to the OBS software so yeah actually that is <laughs> that is it it's really uh, quick and easy to do I'm going to I'm going to show uh the settings here. You just go down here, display settings, video output settings. This is where you go. And as you can see, I have like the component to uh yeah, component input. And that is yeah, you can see here, you have a choice. 560p, 780p, 1080p interlace and 1080p, 1080i I mean, that's interlace. 1080p so yeah it is HD yeah, I'll just I will just cancel that because you have already set it up and yeah connect it to OBS and uh, you can adjust your mics volume here and your uh, video capture device volume so I like my uh, my mic to be louder than the game audio because I do commentary but sometimes if I, I don't do commentary, I just set this one to full. So that's around yeah, close to minus 40 
dB minus 20 dB for my mic. Yeah, I don't want to. If you put it on max, it will go to red here. You clip your audio. So yeah, also be careful with that. So yeah, basically that's that's it. Really simple thing to do here. You ju you just need two devices, the composite cable and the uh, composite to HDMI converter, and of course OBS, which is free. And that's it. You can uh, record that way and even stream that way. PS3 here and. Uh, it will also do PS2 gameplay. I'll teach you on another video how to record PS2 gameplay also on OBS. So yeah, that's it. Hope you enjoy this one. And uh, don't forget to like the video, subscribe. And uh, see you on the next episode. Thank you for watching. And uh, have a great day. Bye-bye.